Because of these storms, a family farm is now destroyed after the hail tore up its crops. We were talking about that hail. Yeah. This is it. Hugger Root Family Farms in Buffalo Gap says it's devastated by the storm, but already looking to rebuild. KTAB's Claire Kreitz has their story. The sun was shining. Um, in about 15 minutes, the sky turned black. Oh my gosh. And uh, it just, for lack of better terms, the garden got the hail beat out of it. H-A-I-L. Months of dedication poured into this family garden. I saw the first hailstone. I looked at my phone. It was 513, and it hailed till 525. Gone within a blink of an eye. This is lettuce, y'all. looks like confetti now. Hugger Root Family Farms in Buffalo Gap grows about 30 different varieties of plants, serving individual families with home deliveries and even donates to local nonprofits. But this storm? This is just not hail damage right here. This is straight line wind damage. Could wipe out quite a bit of their selection. There's nothing we can do about an event like this, but at the same time, we can look at it and go, hey, this this sucks. The goal is to donate anywhere between twelve to $15,000 of food this year. But because of the hail and the strong winds, it's uncertain if any of these plants will be salvageable. See all this bruising? That's where those hailstones hit it, and then you can smell it, and and so that that's where the plant gets its energy from. That's the plant's solar panels. While an event like this can be devastating for any farmer, we either go home and cry, or we get to work. There is no time to dwell on the uncontrollable, but instead focus on rebuilding. And we'll let the Lord decide what the bounty is. It's not it's not my responsibility to decide the outcome. It's just my responsibility to do the work. In Buffalo Gap, with coverage you can count on, Claire Kreitz, KTAB News. Thank you, Claire. The farm is taking donations and volunteers with gardening experience to help rebuild. To find out how to help, you can visit our website, BigCountryHomePage.com.